What's good? What's good? What is good, my sizers? We're back again with another video, and today we're at the Flamingo Casino. So when you come from the parking garage on your right, there'll be access to the monorail. You do have to pay for it. The rates are different depending on what type of pass you want. But right here is the pool because pool season's over with, so it wasn't open for me to show you. But that was the pool, and the go pool that was down at the bottom is for 21 and over only. The Flamingo also has a designated Uber spot for you to pick up and drop off at. And they also have a FedEx office. RuPaul's Drag Race is here as a show at the Flamingo, and this is their gift shop. If you can't find it, it's on the first floor as soon as you come from the parking lot. And it's next to their spa and gym. Flamingo is an old casino, but they do have a lot of kid-friendly activities, and they also have a wide variety of shows here as well. This is like some bar. It didn't have a name to it, but it was shut down. They do have a cafe called the Nook Express, and this thing stayed busy the entire time I was there, and I was there for a few hours. So if you go out the doors and take a right, you're led with this area and this sign. You can go to the Flamingo Pool or the Club Pool. There's a wedding chapel right here. Um, this also leads you to the Flamingo Habitat exhibit, which is actually really cool. This is part of their pool. They do have others, and there's a slide in this one. So let me know if you noticed it. This area here is a dog relief area. They are pet friendly and you can let your dog just roam around and go to the bathroom here. They also have a restaurant in the back right there called Carlos and Charlie's. This is the Flamingo Fountain and it's really cool at nighttime. It like lights up and is super pretty. I definitely suggest going there for pictures, believe it or not. Also, this leads to the Flamingo Habitat, which you're about to see in a few seconds. This is also a really nice photo op with the sign and the waterfall in the back. So this habitat has ducks, koi fish, birds, like, like pigeons, obviously. Um, but they also have flamingos. But the cool thing about this is that this area right here is where they host shows and little performances. And they teach you about the habitat and stuff. They do have specific dates and times that they go to. And here's the Flamingos. This is where they host like their shows and stuff. I did not make it on time for that. Sorry. Um, but coming back into the casino, that's where you have your conference center. It's down those escalators. And they have actually quite a few like little gift shops and um, essentials areas. Okay, this store, Marshall Russo, is everywhere in Vegas. So I don't know if it's new, but it's definitely hot here. But if you're looking for souvenirs and you just can't seem to find the one, I definitely suggest going to Flamingo because they have millions of stores that just have Vegas merch. This is a salon where you can get your mani pedis and your hair done. So that's actually really cool because that's like a whole entire salon. Here's another mini cafe, though it was closed down. This is where check-in, check-out, registration, all that good jazz is. It does not seem busy, but that's because I came on a week day they also have this bake shop express vending machine where they sell cakes from i believe buddy um his restaurant or bakery i guess is in the venetian i believe they also have a lobby bar that was closed down but i'm pretty sure everything is just more open at nighttime so here are the table games they do have a lot of tables and all of them were active but they were active on the opposite side but all the tables are open at nighttime as you can see in the bright corner there was people playing at the tables anyways there's a bugsy bar as well and this is the showroom it's next to the bugsy bar and next to the tables i just showed you they have rupaul wayne newton and a few other shows that are super great to check out they also have a food court it's newly renovated as you can see very clean very spotless they do have johnny rockets la subs and a few other food options i forgot to mention um, this is the burlesque show. This is where the theater is for the burlesque show. You only have to be 18 and over to go to there. So if you have a child um, that's 18 and over, that, that's a good show to go to. They do have a sports book too. It's hidden in a corner, but it's next to registration and the Carlos and Charlie's restaurant. They also have a garden bar, which the cool thing about this is that you can look and see into the habitat from earlier. The Flamingo is known for the Bugsy and Myers Steakhouse and 
it is open it's open at night though and as you're walking out of the flamingo they have those wide windows from floor to ceiling so you can look into the habitat as you're leaving as well but yeah that's the actual entrance to the steakhouse and it is open for dinner and this exit takes you to the link promenade which will be sunday's video so look out for that and in the description below i will have the monorail rates and types of passes but as usual i'm out of time so you guys know what to do toodles <laughs>